One of the coolest seasons in the year is Black Friday because you either get to make a lot of sales or buy the things you need to buy at a lower price. And in this video, we are not going to be looking at those who want to buy, we are looking at those who want to sell. So I'll be teaching you how to create a beautiful Black Friday banner where you can put on your website, social media, anywhere at all you want to publish it at, you can just use it. And I'll also show you how to get a template for free as well. And if you're new to this channel, make sure to subscribe because this alone opens the door for more exciting Canva tutorials for you. Okay, so let's dive straight into it. This is what we are going to be creating and all I have to do is to click on add a page, okay? And just in case you're looking for this dimension, you can simply come to banner, okay? So any banner at all, you can just, you know, search for it and you should find something like this, okay? The background color I am using for this design is 191919, okay? So what we are simply going to do is to come into element. That's the first thing. Make sure you're searching for triangle, okay? So select it and you should see something like this, okay? So all we are going to do is to drag it down so we can get this type of triangle and rotate it okay i can rotate it something like this and we'll just change the color so we'll come to color and we are going to use the color 42303c okay so once you select it this is something you should get all right nice so let's leave this here for the meantime and the next thing you have to do is to press c on your keyboard okay once you do that you can choose any bright color of your choice i'm going for this purple which is ff0099 okay so you can just select it and increase the size to any size at all you want okay so after you do that make sure you're clicking on it again come to gradient okay and in gradient make sure you're choosing the circular gradient after you do that come to the second color and make sure you're making it transparent okay then add a new color just so you can get this effect okay so you can increase it a little bit then select your triangle and duplicate it okay now we are just going to rotate the triangle according to how we want it and the sizes can vary okay so just make sure you are being creative at this point, okay? So duplicate again, and I'm just going to speed up the whole process of these duplications. So now that you have that, make sure you're selecting all of them. Okay, so select every triangle, right click, come to layer and come to send to back. Okay, so this is how everything should be looking. In fact, let me just rotate this better. Okay, nice, nice, nice. So once you're done doing this, the next thing you need to do is to press T on your keyboard to add a text. Okay, and I'm simply going to say Black Friday. Okay, so the black should be very big. All right, so very big like that. Then we can just see Friday as well. Okay, I don't know why. I always get to press ctrl f instead of ctrl d are you playing what type of plane is this so black friday like this select all the two and it should be here i know i haven't said the friday yet okay so come here okay and i'll just say friday okay now select this and we'll just come into the text area and i'm going to change it to the poppins extra board i just love that font i don't know why but i just love it so i'll choose white for this come to position just make sure it's centered okay now we are going to apply some effect to the text so come to effect come to shadow and i'm going to change this to i can change this to you know this color and just make it like this okay then with the offset or the you no know, the direction first we we'll just change the direction to maybe 30 okay 30 which is very very cool then the next thing we are simply going to do is i'll just want us to increase the size a little bit okay so now duplicate this and you can just change the font type to isam script okay isam script then we are going to say amazing deals available okay it's available just to say something cute okay and you can just say anything at all you want to say so don't be pressured oh my god okay don't be pressured to follow what i'm saying just feel free and express yourself in your design okay so i'll put this here and white on white can be difficult sometimes so this is what we are going to do come into effect okay in effect make sure you are choosing shadow okay and the color should be black for the shadow then the blur you can just send it all the way to zero and increase the transparency okay just so that we can see the difference all right now duplicate this okay then come into color and change the color to this purple and we are just going to leave it around you know just spread it around like that and the sizes should vary okay so something like this then we have this one as well so we can increase the size like this and leave it like this okay and make sure that the pointed part is always pointing to the center okay yeah so we can duplicate this and maybe like this and maybe drag it up like that then duplicate 
replicate it again you know you just have to be creative with all this okay so something like this you have to make sure the rotation is good duplicate it again something like this so we can put this here then i'm going to duplicate it for the last time uh, maybe leave it somewhere here and somewhere here like this so we can see what we have at the moment now one last thing we would want to do in fact let me send this up because for the last thing we want to add is to press r on your keyboard okay and you just have to resize the shape like this move it here and stretch it up okay then make sure you're coming to the border style and increase the border rounding to 56 all right then press t on your keyboard to add a text place it on top come into the font whatever and choose maybe poppins regular okay then you can say anything so i'll say up to 50 percent discount okay so up to 50 percent discount okay and i'll make it all caps okay then i'll increase the size to something like this select it or and just position it somewhere here okay so something like that just to make it dramatic select it come into effect okay add the shadow change the color of the shadow to black okay and this is what we have at the moment you can see this is what we created now the last thing the last thing to add is let me just come in here and all you need to search for is half tone element okay so you can just search for half tone just to find this cute element then change the color to purple duplicate it okay and rotate it then you can position it anywhere you want so maybe i'll just leave for the sake of this tutorial i'll just have this two over here and yes this is how i created this in canva just in case you the free version of canva there's a link in the description box below that can help you use canva pro for free the name is benjamin always remember there is no limit to creativity and i should see you in my next video